Hi, it's Deanna, and today I'm going to show you something interesting. Um, I have a couple of videos showing these type of things. It's an antique Victorian pocket watch chain with fob charm, and it is not made out of beads. It is not made out of uh, jewelry, um, like gold or silver, but it is made out of human hair. And during the Victorian times, um, this was very popular when someone passed away their loved ones sent their hair into a mail order catalog and picked from a catalog a design and chose um, what kind of uh, metal mountings and charms they wanted and had their loved one's hair turned into a piece of jewelry. And besides pocket watch chains, they had necklaces, bracelets, pins, brooches, um, belts, earrings, you name it. They probably made it and this particular piece probably was made sometime in the 1880s maybe 1890s and uh, it is none other than what I said earlier a pocket watch chain with a charm fob and generally men wore these but ladies wore them as well pocket watches uh, were very popular at the time and they attached their pocket watches to these chains and attach them to the buttonholes or place them in pockets of their outfits. This one's very nice. It has a really nice uh, charm with, I don't even know if this is real gold, this charm with real diamonds. I don't have a jewelry tester, so I'll probably not know unless I get it tested. This looks like it's a uh, gold filled um, metal. It has a T-bar more metal and here's the weave it's quite interesting um all this uh craftsmanship that went into this let me try to show you in detail this weaving So this was one somebody who, who was alive at the time. Well, actually, all the people that lived during this time have no past. But this was a way to commemorate somebody's life and hold them close and near to them. Besides um, hair of the deceased, sometimes sweethearts would exchange this as a gift for their gentleman uh, lover or husband or boyfriend or fiance. So for example, a lady would send her hair into one of these catalog companies and as a gift, she would give this to uh, the love of her life and he could carry around a piece of her hair as a memento and token of her love for him. So not all of these had morbid um, associations. So once again, thank you for watching another one of my videos. If you like what you see, hit the subscribe button and thumbs up.